Hey y'all, welcome back. So this video is basically a life update because I haven't posted in God knows how long, like with like up to date current content. So it's 2024, I'm bringing it to you guys because it's no more excuses. So life update, what I've been up to since graduation. So basically I've had two jobs since graduating. One job I was at for about two months. I was a chiropractic assistant. Um, it was cool, learned a lot, uh, but I ended up losing that job over a TikTok video that I posted. So yeah, I'd rather not talk about it, but if you want a story time, let me know down in the comments. I might get it to you because it just grinds my gears. I can, anyway, anyway, I have a new job now. I'm here at, another office in Palm Bay. I was about to tell you what it is, but I'd rather not do that. Um, but so I'm at another office in Palm Bay. It's awesome. I love it here. I'm a case manager slash chiropractic assistant. So I'm assisting the doc with a lot of the therapies, uh, along with another one of the, my coworkers. And, um, I'm also handling like all the insurance verification, billing, um, sending out all the the EOBs and like things that we basically didn't learn at Palmer. I'm learning it, the back end of it here at this job. So it's like kind of like I'm still in the office. I'm learning the back end stuff that I never got at Palmer, but I'm not adjusting right now, only when I'm at home for practice purposes. Uh, but yeah, that's basically it. Um, but I like it here. It's great. Uh, we're actually getting a second location very soon. Um, so that'll be in the works. I'll let y'all know when that is. So that way if we have like a, um, I think we're going to have like a grand opening. So if you guys want to come, let me know. I can drop the details in like a Instagram post or something for those that like actually live around me. Um, but yeah, I like it. So yeah, moving on. Um, I take boards on Saturday, part one. So I don't know if many of you know this or not, but I actually did not pass all of my boards before graduating. I had my baby. So, okay. It's not going to be a story time, but if you're new here. So when I started chiropractic school, I had a three month old baby and I was still breastfeeding literally all online classes. I'm breastfeeding while I'm in class. Like, I mean, they couldn't see me, but I'm literally in class, like with my child. Um, and that was for about three or four quarters. Um, when we went back on campus, it was amazing. I loved it. Got very hands on because we had to, you know what I mean? Because we had time to make up. Um, but quarter eight, I still have PTSD from it. But quarter eight, <laughs> I had my second child. Um, yeah, it was unexpected but you know we roll with what we got you know and i love my baby he's a blessing and yeah we just had to we just had to adapt and you know move some things around so one of those things that i had to move around was boards um while pregnant going through school it was very hard um so i'm just happy to have graduated on time you know and the only thing that i have to worry about now is boards i have a job so i'm not stressing um, yeah, so, but I wasn't able to take, so I completed all of part two. Part two is done. Now I have part one, pathology and physiology, which I take on Saturday, which by the time this video is posted may have already been passed out. I don't know. Um, but, um, and then once I pass that exam, so you have to pass all of part one to open up three and four, three and four. Okay, so that was the thing for me that was holding me up because I could have been taking three and four, but because I haven't passed all of part one, which is like the academic side, like if you don't know this, you can't move on type deal. So I have to pass pathology and physiology on Saturday. Once that opens up, I actually find out if I pass two days before my birthday and then I sign up for part three and four and guess how much those exams are. Yeah, part three is like $1,100 and then part four is about fourteen hundred dollars plus travel because i'm signing up so late so because it'll be like two days before the deadline closes for applications uh to to sign up um i'll probably end up having to fly out somewhere and you can fly out to anywhere you can fly to oklahoma uh north dakota like wherever i gotta go is basically where i gotta go so luckily it'll be in may so it ain't gonna be cold anywhere i go hopefully fingers crossed <laughs> but yeah, so that's that's basically it. 
I'm ready for part three and four. I'm ready to get this over with so I can start practicing, get my hands on people, adjusting so I can just start mastering my craft even more, guys. Like, I'm so excited. Like, it's making the back of my head hurt. I don't know if it's this headband or what, but I'm lit. I'm ready. I'm delayed, but I'm not denied. I'm just waiting. I'm waiting. I'm being patient because I know something is in the works for me that is either what I'm asking for or better. So I'm just gotta be patient. That's it. Um, let me stay on track on track. Um, yeah, I'm trying to recover from school. Like I low key have PTSD from some of the quarters. I have to remind myself that I still don't have homework because I'm done with school, but then it don't feel like it because I still need to study. So technically I do have homework. I need to study, but it's for boys. It's not for graduation purposes. It's for license purposes. So yeah um what else starting my podcast i'm still trying to figure out a name i think i'm going with the mom's club but it's basically about empowering women to change their mindset manifest and make money moves they don't necessarily have to be money moves but that's mainly what i'm focusing on is like enhancing your financial freedom like getting your financial freedom enhancing your life i've just been on a nice spiritual journey lately and um i just feel like i'm on i'm on the up and up now like I'll, I'll that'll be another video but for right now it's all things mom life empowering moms women to have a voice um manifestation learning how to manifest learning how to meditate just it making moves like holding yourself accountable so yeah stay tuned for that i will keep you updated with when that drops stay tuned for the premiere i think that was all i had so yeah, thanks for sticking with me. If you haven't already, subscribe down below. Leave me a comment and like this video. And I'll see you in the next one. Bye.